sorry to bother you, I... Might as well come in. Thanks. You got hurt? Oh, I must have scraped myself on a tree outside. That'll happen when you go walking through the scrub at night. Warm up by the fire. I'm sure they have a dermal regenerator here somewhere. Oh, where is it? Good as new. Thank you. Have a seat. You like a drink? Um, Earl Grey tea, please. So what brings you to the middle of Australia? I'm researching influential starship captains for my graduation essay at the Academy. Thanks. So, why are you here? I told you I'm writing. Yes, yes, an essay on influential captains in Starfleet. But why are you here? I want to write about more than just the flagship captains. Because there are more to influential battles and missions of peace than just Kirk, Picard, Sisko and Janeway. I see, and you think I'm one of these captains? Your Captain Donovan Lindsay? Yes. You've been on permanent leave from active duty for six months. Why is that? I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. Today seems right to tell someone. Do you mind if I take notes? No. Promise me one thing. Anything. Please listen. Sure. Captain's log, stardate 52375.3. The Treaty of Bajor has been signed. This war is at an end, finally. After three long years on the front lines, it's time for the Sydney to return home. Before we get there, though, we're investigating a coded message on a Starfleet emergency frequency. Anything more to report on the message, Ensign? Yes, sir. It's definitely Commander Ellis's coat, dated the day he went missing. Where's it coming from? A Federation merchant ship, dead ahead. Helm, slow to impulse. Aye, sir. Definitely a Federation merchant ship. Isn't this an odd place for them? Well, the nearest trade route is Five Light Easway, sir. There have been reports of merchant ships using this sector to avoid the typhus expanse. Helm, slow to one quarter impulse. Don't want to get too close. Lieutenant, open a channel to that ship. Federation trading vessel, this is Captain Donovan Lindsay on the USS Sydney. Identify yourself. Federation trading vessel, this is Captain Lindsay on the Sydney. Please identify yourself. Hanley, what are you thinking? I've triple checked the code, sir. It could only have come from Commander Ellis on that ship. USS Sydney, this is the Zelanda. How can we help? We're investigating an anomalous message in this area. Please lower your shields and prepare to be boarded. Boarded? Boarded. Yes, boarded. Please proceed. Sir? I don't know. But if there is even a chance of rescuing Commander Ellis, we must try. Bring us into transporter range, Henson. Come hard about, give us some room to move. Battle stations. Return fire. Damage report. 
The shuttle bay has been destroyed. The battle was decisive, that's for sure. We had no idea the Cardis had outfitted their older style ships with these sort of weapons, let alone masking technology. At any rate, we were in for the fight of our lives and no one was going to save us. to the starboard nacelle. We're venting plasma. Engineering, report. Engineering. Will, can you give me one last volley? Yes, sir. Let's see if we can even the odds. Target her engines! Ramming speed! All hands, abandon ship. Bulkhead landed on my head when the Cardassian ship exploded. The next thing I know, I'm in an escape pod with Lieutenant Clement. Did you ever find Commander Ellis? No. The Board of Inquiry determined that Mike must have broken under the interrogation and given them the code. Is that what you believe? Honestly, I don't know what to believe. My dad would never have given them the information. You are, aren't you? I haven't seen you since you were this big. You're not writing an essay, are you? No. I'm trying to clear my dad's name. What good am I? No one listened to me 12 months ago. You always were a stick in the mud, Donovan. How? He found me, actually. How did you survive? And where the bloody hell have you been for 12 months? I was never on the ship. They kept a group of us on an asteroid somewhere deep within their territory. Since we were classified KIA, no one seemed to look. About a month ago, I managed to bribe a, a Fringy merchant to, uh, to smuggle a message out to Starfleet. <laughs> Looks like you've made quite a home for yourself here. She served me well. Okay, when you two are done reminiscing. Oh, right. How can I help? Donovan. That found the city and the Cardassian ship. They're both dead hulks. But the investigation has turned up some interesting findings. They spent five months trying to pin Sydney's loss on me. Even the Cardassian Central Command tried to have me extradited for war crimes. In their eyes, the war was over and I was guilty. As far as I was concerned, the moment that damn ship fired first, we were back at war. Did what I had to do to protect my crew. Nobody blames you for that. Certainly tried to. I should have retreated, called for reinforcements, something other than trying to rescue Starfleet POWs. What were they doing running under a masking cloak? How did they get that technology? Donovan, this is what I've been trying to tell you. They found the evidence. Evidence you needed back then to prove your claims. We're hopeful that the history books are ready to record this as a ferric victory. You did what you had to do. 
please come back with us.